let's first of all construct these two triangles. I think it really helps to sort of see where the two solutions come from. So let's say this is AB. And then I've got a uh, 45 degree angle at B. So I'm just going to extend this quite far. Um, and then I want AC to equal 16 centimetres. So let's imagine that I put my compass at 16 centimetres and I, I bring it round like so. Then there are two places along this line that give me uh, this AC equal to 16 centimetres. That's what my compass is showing me. So the first one be here and then I'll get a second triangle here. So in both cases I get um, I get AC equal to 16 but I've got two separate triangles as you can see. So let's just label them up. Uh, this one I've still got, I've got A and B now, and this is going to be C, this is 45 degrees, this is 20, and this is 16, and the same is going to be the case for this one. However, you can see that the two angles are slightly different. Actually, this solution gives me an acute angle, whereas this solution will give me an acute angle. So um, I thought it was worth just talking about that to see to see the two solutions, but let's crack on and find them. So what we have here is we have opposite pairs that we know, and then we've got opposite pairs, but one that we don't know. This is shouting out for the sine rule, and we can write down that sine of C is equal, sorry, sine of C divided by 20 is equal to sine 45 divided by 16. Rearranging gives sine c equals 5 root 2 over 8. Solving, we find inverse sine, and that gives us 62.114. But we, well, we've seen there's two solutions. How do we get the other solution? Well, if we understand the sine curve, we've just found out this one. So we want this one over here, this obtuse one. And to do that, we do 180 minus 62.14. Okay, and that will give us our two solutions, which we need to write correct to one decimal place, 62.1 degrees or 117.9 degrees. Okay, so that is part one sorted. Given instead that the area of the triangle is 75 root two, find BC. Okay, so this time, I've still got my AB, still got my 45 degree angle. So 20, um, I've got that this is 45 degrees, this is A, B, C, and I want to find out what B, C is, so this one here. Now, there's a formula for finding the area of the triangle um, given an angle, and it is that the area is half A, B, sine C. C is the angle that's like opposite to the side that's not the little C. So in this case, it's going to be a half times 20 times BC times sine 45. And that is going to equal the uh, 75 root 2. Okay, so now I just need to solve this. 
I can write down that, um, I'm just going to simplify it first. So half times 20 is 10. Sine of 45 is 1 over root 2. So I can write this as 10 over root 2 BC equals 75 root 2. Now I can multiply both sides by root 2 to give me 10 BC equals 150. So I see that BC is going to equal 15 centimeters.